Well, right now you're paying more for just about everything. So yard sales are a great way to find what you need for less and even add a little earn a little cash. Yeah, 10 TV's Lindsay Mills shares the details on a massive community wide sale involving more than 100 participants happening in two days. It's the season where the signage is everywhere and the competition is intense. I'm not talking about politics. I'm talking about purging. It is more than just purging, although that is really nice too. For Katie Swindle. So we've got Llama Llama Red Pajama, Big Red Barn. This year's sale. I love these books. Is a chance for her daughter to raise money to cover the cost of summer camp. I think they're going to be 50 cents a book. A win-win. You know, families can get what they need. Saturday, May 14th, the city of Bexley is organizing a massive community yard sale. It's good for residents. It's good for those who are looking for a good deal. It's also really good for the environment. At the city's website, you can see all the locations to map your route ahead of time. You see where the hosts are and what they're selling. In search of kids' clothes or baby gear, just click a point for a detailed inventory. The sale goes from 8 to 1. But... If you hold off until the afternoon, you may be able to save even more. From 1 to 5, the event transforms to a free cycle. Neighbors can place unsold items between the curb and the sidewalk that are free for the taking. And I'm excited to see people, see people out and about, finally get to visit with neighbors. It would just be nice to see everybody. At last check, there were 152 homes registered for the sale, a new record. In Bexley, Lindsay Mills, 10TV News.